Ow. Looks like we gotta take a different route. Oh, you can't be serious. I'm, my horse is going to die. Oh my god, no, no! I thought I said I could safely do it. Those lying scumbags. I will avenge you, horsey. I'm sorry. I'm actually depressed right now, guys. They're gonna die! I think that happened last time, too. It said that you could safely go down it like that, but I think it just ended up killing my horse, too. Then again, it could entirely be my fault as well. So I just gotta steal one of these guys' horses. Where do they get so many Gatlin guns? Come on. Good. I thought I was getting headshots on him. At least I thought. I think the Vulcan guns are actually really powerful. I'm gonna heal up a bit. take this better rival and this better quick shooter Let's see what else is around here Where's 
the girl. I know who you are. I recognized you the moment I saw you. Only one man alive has a huevos to wear armor like that. Who do you think you are? A knight in shining armor, slaying dragons and saving fair damsels? Your day is done, old man. Your time has come. You've had a good run, but now it's my turn. Draw your weapon. Defeat Ty Stewart in a gunfight. All right, let's do this. Okay, I barely got him. That was close. Where have they taken that girl? Today you'll stand in front of the Almighty, facing your judgment. So you better talk while you still can, you low life son of a bitch. Where have they taken that girl? What? Juarez. Juarez? Do you know who killed Billy's parents? Do you know who killed my brother? Juarez. Speak! You hear me? Tell me! Juarez. So, all the events have come full circle. Is that what you wanted, Lord? Alright, that's the finish of a very epic episode. Let's just continue right into the next one. There is one candle, but three graves. The gold of Juarez belongs only to the brave. This medallion is for you, my darling. I want you to wear it always. Put it on over your corazón. The candle engraved upon it will light your path and protect you from evil. There's only one candle, but three graves. In the first grave, a bad man sleeps. He might wake up, so... Shh. In the second one, a rich man, a heart of stone, slumbers. For him, the gift will not be enough. In the third grave, a beggar lays. You need to light the candle for him, because a little warmth means a lot to a poor man. He'll give you the gold, because the poor are always more generous than the rich. There is one candle, but three graves. The gold of Juarez belongs only Calm water? Oh, where am I? Was I dreaming? Do I have to do everything myself? I told you what I need. I'm sure the boy knows where it is. He probably just hid it somewhere. We'll find it. We better find it, Baboso. Sorry about the rough stuff. Sometimes Manson can be a little overly, um, enthusiastic. Who are you? Don't you see the resemblance, muchacho? I'm your padre. What? Seventeen years ago, your mama ran off with another man. You were still in her womb. My only son, my pride and joy. I've been searching for you ever since. So you have my mother killed? Of course not. What kind of man do you think I am? Her husband started shooting, and my men had to defend themselves. Your poor mama got caught in the crossfire. So you're my... my father? That's right, mijo. They call me Juarez, because that is where I'm from. Juarez. See, si, that's where we are, in my Alcazar, just outside the city. Once we get our hands on the gold, we'll be the most powerful family in northern Mexico. 
Just give me the medallion and the future is ours. Medallion? Why? Don't play games with me, Mijo. I know your mother gave it to you. I don't have it. I, I lost it in the river. You're my son. Together we rule all of Juarez. But first you must give me the medallion. I told you, I don't know. I gave you life, and I can take it away. Tell me where it is. I don't have it. Do you think I'm stupid? Is that what you think? You tell me what I need to know, or I will end you right here. The medallion is the key. The key to where the gold is buried. It's a riddle and a mystery, but I knew eventually that I would find it. But then your mama, that puta, stole it from me. Ah! and made off with her lover, a gringo, and nobody. She took what was mine, and for that there is no forgiveness. <clears throat> for 17 years, I've been looking for you. 17 years! <clears throat> what? It hurts. This is nothing. These are love taps. Tell me where the medallion is, or you will wish you were never born. <clears throat> where? <clears throat> Everything I did for you! First your mother, then for you. You better speak, Chilito. Talk. You're stubborn, but I don't give up. You will fetch me that medallion or else. Come. Recognize her. Her father wasn't so lucky. Molly! No. Oh. I don't care where it is. You just bring it back to me. Or I will give her to the men for their amusement. She will suffer a very sad end. You've got some time. Till some. Man, what a dick. He didn't even give him a chance to really talk, and he legit lost it. And he was just like, no, you're hiding it from me. Like, what, you can't, you can't think that might be a chance? Just what a dickhead. Don't show up here without the medallion. You've got until sundown. All right, I remember this mission actually uh, very specifically because I struggled on this for a time because I just couldn't get like a whip to hit the right spot. But I remember this one specifically. I think first we have to go to like a cemetery or something and help out some kid. Which so we take this way first. Senor, want to do a little business? I'll give you a hundred pesos to bury my father. But the funeral has to be primera classe. Well? Aren't you going to say something? Like what? A few words from my father. I'm not a priest. You want the hundred pesos or not? All right. Dear uh, Lord, uh, we are here today to honor, uh, what was his name? Arturo. Arturo, a good man, a kind man, a dead man. We bid him farewell. Keep Antonio. Arturo. Arturo, forever in our hearts and in this box, amen. All right, I buried Armando. <gasps> Arturo. Right, so where's my money? I'd like to give you the hundred pesos, but I don't have a hundred pesos. Well, how many pesos do you have? None. Did you really think a little boy like me would have a hundred pesos? The only thing I have and can give you is this key to the sacristia in the abandoned church. You'll probably find something worth something there. Oh, and senor, remember for the future, a poor man will always offer you more than a rich man. 
Hmm, that sounds familiar. Alright, let's actually head to that, uh... That sacristy is what it's called? I don't know, it's like a, the abandoned church. I'll just call it the abandoned church. Can't remember exactly what he called that one place that the key unlocks. Let's go ahead. I can't win for losing. What's in here? Nah, nothing. That must be where a secret was last time I played. Uh. Three tombs. Hold on. One candle, but three graves. Where to light it? How did it go? God. The first grave had a bad man. He might wake, so shush. Are shaped like my medallion. In the first grave, a bad man sleeps. He might wake up. Shh. In the second one, a rich man with a heart of stone slumbers. For him, the gift will not be enough. In the third grave, a poor man lays. He'll have a candle for him. Because a little warmth means a lot to a poor man. He'll give you the gold. Because the poor are always more generous. Gold. How did it look? I can almost see it in my mind's eye. That stone over there. It fits. There's the entrance. The poor are always more generous. So let's go over that stone. No way. I can't move it this way. It's too heavy. So I think we have to go back to the church and just climb our way around so we can get that boulder to hit it out of the way. Again, why am I whispering? It's pointless. for this branch up here. This was the branch I was talking about earlier. The first time I played this, I just cannot get on it. It's annoying. There we go. Aha! Crap, I gotta go back around. I went the wrong way.
Ow. That wasn't even that big of a distance. Oh well. Well, I'm still alive, so I can't be mad. One candle, three graves, the gold of Juarez belongs only to the brave. Oh, that was... I thought the episode was going to continue from there. Alright, well... Yeah, 100% accuracy, guys. I'm the most accurate, accurate shooter in the entire world. Nah, I'm just kidding. But Alright, let's just continue. It's, getting, it's just building up now. Sounds like someone's riding their motorcycle outside. I might be able to hear a lot of things that you guys can, so if I talk about something and you don't know what I'm talking about, it's probably because I'm hearing something. Alright, this mission only irked me because there are, like, spiders in this mission, and uh, uh. They sound like they're, like, giant monsters. What the hell? Yeah, where are they are? Where are they? There they are. Ah, die. Let's go this way. Uh Get away. You want some of this? Want some of Billy Candle, motherfuckers? Oh, thank God for a saving point. I see more spiders. Well, that's a lot of them. You want some of this? More of them. Got the drop on those two. Gotta go this way. Uh, I hear him. Want some of this? You get away from me. Ah! What the hell's going on there? <laughs> Ow. Alright, where's you next? It looks like we gotta start making our way over here.
I think we're supposed to go up here. I could be wrong. Let's actually head back down. Maybe I'm wrong. We gotta head down under instead. Oh, now I remember. I think we gotta go down this waterfall. Yeah, we do. Save point. That's always good. Aha! Finally made it. More of these spiders. Get away! You want some too? Okay. Let's see here. Looks like we gotta jump on these because they seem unique. Well, I'm dead. And as you can tell, if you step on anything else, you will get hit and you will die. That's never good. Okay, so let's try this again. Careful now. Right, one more. All right. Straight path. I think. I think these collapse. I'm just gonna book it. Yep, I was right. Made it! Yay! find your way to the gold. So I follow you. Why? Why did you lie to me? You betrayed me, just like your mother. And now you'll die, just like she did, on her knees. Who is he? I'm out. Oh, that was close. Warriors is a big dickhead. He's a good villain. I'll say that much. <laughs> 